Right, good afternoon everyone. It's I'm inside for a change. It's currently freezing outside, cold, wet, dark. Uh, it's about 20 past 4 in the afternoon on Wednesday. I'm about to get picked up anytime soon by Ben. And we're going to head down to Sully Hill Moors to watch Manchester United women take on Birmingham City ladies in the Conti Cup. Now, um, this is my first midweek blog, so um, hopefully it'll be a bit better because in the previous ones I've always been knackered in the morning because I'm getting up at a stupid o'clock. But obviously... It's afternoon this, it's great. So um, yeah, it's going to be a cold one, so I've got thermals and my coat on. And um, he'll keep you updated during the game. Stay tuned for more. So yeah, I'm a complete idiot. Um, where was to get picked up for, by Ben? And um, then I just realised, I forgot my ticket. So I've got to nip around the corner and get it. And obviously as I come outside, he's chucking it down. So yeah, um, getting a bit wet. But at least I remember my ticket and I'll see you at the ground. So just arrived on time, we thought we were going to be late because there's a load of traffic and we set off late. But um, yeah, big massive change to the team, Rambo's in goal, um, Valley Green's playing which is a bit of a surprise, um, Lotter is, so it's obviously uh, not the strongest team but we still should be good enough to beat these. Um, Kickoff's going to be anytime soon. I'm going to go for, I don't know, 1-0, I'm going to make the easy way out 1-0 but yeah, we should, we should be winning with the team we've got. We've still got some of them on the bench if we need them. So, yeah, um, you can see it's not a bad place. Um, all the United fans over there. But, yeah, we should be doing this game. Catch it. Yeah, yeah. Right, teams are coming out now. Keep 
parries it, and then just what a mix up between the defender and the goalkeeper. Oh, and then Jay Moss is there to put it in, probably the easiest goal she'll score to be honest. 2-0. Honestly, I don't think he's keeping up to it, so should just be peppering it out. We've been on top past 10-15 minutes and they've just gone down the other end and scored 2-1. Um, they deserve it, probably not, but it is what it is. 2-1. Come on, Red! Come on! Half time 2-1. Um, we've been on top really. I don't really I need to see their goal back, but it was just like their one proper attack really. They had obviously had a couple of other shots but nothing in them miles wide, but we just gotta pepper this keeper. She's probably been our man of the match because both our goals have come from her mistakes, she's been dreadful, so if we keep Crossing them crosses in, you know, um, pretty tough, hard, hard shots, crosses, sorry, and hard shots, he's going to spill them, so that's what we've got to do for the second half, and we should have this game, no problem. Anyway, that's half time. See you for the second half. Teams are out, and Zellum's going off, which you can expect, because obviously we've got playing these again on Sunday in the league, but Molly Green's come off, and um, does that spell the end for her? Obviously, she's not really done much in this game. And obviously this is the game where she has to prove herself and you, I'd have thought she'd played the full 90 minutes in fact she started but it's good to be the end of it unfortunately but the way it is now Lauren's on I can see her ripping it to shreds really because this defence and keeper not good enough but yeah I'm expecting a few goals now from Lauren what a chance we could have gone 3-1 up there Lauren James good shot bounced off the crossbar I'm, I'm back to score a goal in this game one or two at least United, Amy Turner's just come off for Kirsty Smith. And um, that's all our soap's done now. So let's hope no one gets injured. Lauren had just had a chance a minute ago as well. She was really in the box from left to right, had a shot, did the side netting, but yeah, she's got to get a goal in this game, she's got to. Brilliant shot by Lauren, took a time with it outside the box, but Heber just made a save, which I'm pretty shocked about because his keeper's been bobbins. But yeah, brilliant save. We're heading for the top corner, but corner coming in now. Challenge, but I don't want to keep going on about the rest of these videos. In that time now, we've not had a best of halves. It's been could have gone either way this really. They had a chance, but I think we're holding on a little bit. Here. We really needed that third goal just to make it comfortable, but the way out there, hopefully it's not like West Ham and those other games are coming out. Right, injury time, just scored a third, we really needed that. Um, looks like L2 got it, I, I unfortunately missed the build up, but apparently Lauren changed it to a three. Um, three one. Yeah, 3-1 and that's it, full-time. That's it, full-time, 3-1, 2-0 with 2, I think, or it could have been.
Tough game in the second half, we have to do what we did. Uh, hopefully, the game on Sunday is going to be a bit better. We're going to have a full set of the squad and we're going to hopefully beat them. Obviously, that's what we need to do that. But yeah, we, that's the end of the couple of the group stage for us. Obviously, it's going to be knockout next. And yeah, we've really enjoyed it so far. Let's hope we can carry on. So yeah, it's um, just gone past two, um, actually what time, yeah about eight minutes past two, um, motorway was shut off and we had to go through a load of traffic, um, I got lift back with Napy because we stayed a bit longer, um, and then when we got to the motorway, he made a mistake and then went back down south, so we went all the way back and then had to come down the um, road again, to um, all through the traffic again, so it's, that's why we're back so late, but... I just wanted to mention the game, yeah, like I said, I don't think it was the best game. Um, but yeah, we got the result, you know, we got the goal right at the end and right at the beginning. So, which was um, always good, you know, first minute and then in, in injury time, it's quite a bizarre one that. But yeah, I enjoyed the game, I thought the ground was great. Um, so I'm looking forward to going back on Sunday to um, see it in the daylight. <laughs> But, um, like I say, it was a changed team. Um, my only worry, really, is Molly Green. She, obviously, not played for a while. She played for the, played for the Devs or the under-21s a couple of times. And she's, um, yeah, she played 45 minutes, taken off at half-time. And you've got to worry about that, thinking, is, is that the end of her kind of thing for United? My hope is that, if it is kind of the end, but to rather put her out on loan till the end of the season... So she gets a run of games, hopefully, and then we'll see how it goes. Because, obviously, last season she was really good for us, but, you know, she got a load of goals. But, just football's cruel sometimes. Um, so, yeah, I'm just, um, more or less, a few more corners to turn before I'm back home. But, yeah, just wanted to leave it on a positive and say, yeah, happy with the result. And, yeah, I'll be back again there Sunday to do another vlog. So, if you have like this, if you could, um, you know, leave a like. Um, subscribe if you liked it and want to see more and also if you leave a comment underneath that would be great so uh, thanks for watching, I'll see you next time